When I was a boy, I dreamed of becoming a footballer. I'm sure many of you shared the same aspiration. We might think we've wasted our talents on the pitch by going out drinking and pursuing other relationships, but in reality, we probably just didn't have the talent to waste in the first place. Some footballers, however, have all the talent in the world, but struggle to function properly or face injuries beyond their control. In this video, we'll explore players who had the brightest futures only to see it all slip away, whether through self-sabotage or other circumstances beyond their control. We won't be covering the obvious cases like Mario Bellatelli or Paul Pogba, as their stories of squandered talent are well known. If you want to go back in time and rectify your wasted talent, make sure to join the 580 talented bucks and subscribe to the channel. Without further ado, let's dive right in. Number five, Ravel Morrison. Ravel Morrison's name once sent waves through the football world, marking him as a future superstar. In 2009, he signed for Manchester United as a first year scholar, turning professional just a year later in February, 2010. It looked like a dream start for the youngster. By October, 2010, Morrison had made his first team debut at just 17 years old in a League Cup win over the Wolves. His career at Old Trafford seemed to be taking off with incredible promise. His finest moment came in 2011 during the FA Youth Cup final. Morrison netted two goals in the second leg, helping United to a 6-3 aggregate victory over Sheffield United. The future looked bright. Despite his talent, Morrison's career derailed quickly due to off-the-field issues. His time at Manchester United was marred by misconduct and constant trouble. Ferguson later reflected in his autobiography, Morrison possessed as much natural talent as any youngster we've ever signed, but kept getting into trouble. The Red Devils eventually let him go in 2012, where he moved to West Ham, but struggled to settle, and subsequent stints at various clubs failed to revive his career. By the time he landed at Derby County under Wayne Rooney, he was seen as another fallen wonder kid. At 31 years old, it's looking unlikely that Morrison will come close to the career many anticipated for him. Number four, Guti. Jose Maria's Gutierrez Hernandez, known as Guti, was one of the most technically gifted players to emerge from Real Madrid's famed academy. With his flair, vision, and passing ability, Guti had all the tools to be a global superstar. Yet, he's often remembered as a failed wonder kid who didn't live up to his potential. Guti's loyalty to Real Madrid may have limited his opportunities to grow. At a club like Real Madrid, competition for places is fierce, and Guti often found himself overshadowed by Galactico stars. He was a rotation player for much of his career, which hindered his ability to develop into a regular starter. Inconsistency was Guti's biggest struggle. On his day, he was capable of moments of absolute genius, but those days were too often followed by anonymous performances. This inconsistency kept him from cementing himself a spot in the starting 11. Off-field controversies and reputation for being undisciplined also contributed to his struggles with consistency and prevented him from reaching the levels many expected. Despite these issues, Guti's career was far from a failure. He won multiple domestic and European titles with Real Madrid, but given his natural ability, the perception lingers that Guti could have been so much more. Number three, Anthony Le Telec. Anthony Le Telec was once regarded as one of football's brightest young talents. His performances for France at youth levels caught the attention of Europe's top clubs, with Liverpool ultimately securing his signature. Le Telec was expected to become a star, but his career didn't follow the predicted path. The early hype around Le Telec placed immense pressure on his young shoulders. This weight of expectation seemed to become more of a burden, affecting his confidence and ability to settle into a rhythm as a professional. Le Telec's development was further disrupted by a series of loan spells to various clubs. These constant moves prevented him from finding the stability needed to truly develop and make his mark. On top of moving around, injuries played a huge role in derailing his progress, affecting both his physical ability and mental resilience. At Liverpool, he faced stiff competition for a place in the first team, making it difficult for him to secure regular playing time. 
Despite the challenges, Anthony Letelec still enjoyed a respectable career, playing for various clubs across Europe. His time in football highlights the fine line between a wonder kid and a journeyman. Number two, Bojan Kerkic. Bojan Kerkic was once the crown jewel of Barcelona's famed La Masia Academy. Touted as the next Lionel Messi, Bojan made his first team debut at just 17, breaking Messi's record. This raised many expectations that he would become the next superstar in world football. One of the biggest hurdles in Boyan's career was his battle with mental health. The pressure of being hailed as Messi's successor triggered severe anxiety attacks, impacting his ability to perform at his best. After his remarkable breakthrough season, Boyan fought hard to maintain a regular spot in the starting lineup at Barcelona. This inconsistent playing time affected his rhythm and development during his formative years. Boyan's career soon became a nomadic journey, with spells at clubs like Roma, Milan, Stoke City, and Mainz. Although, at Stoke City, he's kind of a hero. These frequent transfers disrupted his career progression, making it difficult for him to establish consistency and stability. Despite these setbacks, Boyan still enjoyed a respectable career, playing for various clubs across Europe and even venturing to MLS and Japan before retiring in 2023 at the age of 32. Number 1. Jack Rodwell Jack Rodwell, once hailed as one of England's most promising young talents, seemed destined for greatness. After breaking into the Everton first team at just 16, his calmness on the ball and defensive versatility marked him out as a future star. One of the biggest factors behind Rodwell's failed rise was his constant battle with injuries. Hamstring and muscle problems kept him on the sidelines for extended periods, preventing him from finding the consistency needed to establish himself as a top player. Rodwell was frequently compared to the best midfielders in the game, creating intense pressure. The tag of future England captain magnified every misstep making it difficult for him to grow naturally into his role. After making a high-profile move to Manchester City in 2012, Rodwell struggled to break into the starting 11. The lack of regular playing time at such a crucial point in his career hindered his development. Rodwell has openly spoke out about the impact of mental health issues on his career, admitting to suffering from depression and anxiety. These challenges further compounded his struggles. Despite these setbacks, Rodwell continued to play at various clubs, including Sunderland, Blackburn Rovers, and Sheffield United. The journey from wonder kid to established football star is fraught with challenges, and not every player with immense potential reaches the heights expected of them. As we've seen with these players, natural talent alone is never enough. Whether it's due to off-the-field issues, mental health struggles, injuries, or simply the weight of overwhelming expectations, Many players who once seemed destined for greatness fall short. These stories serve as a reminder that football is as much a mental battle as it is a physical one. The pressure, the spotlight, and the grind of top-level competition can take their toll, even on the most gifted athletes. But while these players didn't reach the pinnacles many hoped for, they still had careers most of us could only dream of. So next time you wonder what could have been for yourself or others, remember, that sometimes the stars just don't align. And even for the most talented, success in football is far from guaranteed.